All right, so finally out of class. And uh, today is November 8th, Tuesday, and it is election day. Now, I had posted something on Facebook earlier. Uh, I was thinking about doing a, a um, video on, on what I think about this whole election thing. So, this will probably be that video, but it's not going to be so as in-depth as I wanted it to be, or I thought. This will be, oh, this will be part of it. I'm not going to do the whole damn video in the fucking car. But it'll be, like, you know, kind of throughout the day. Like, people always ask me, did you vote? I'm like, no. They're like, why? I'm like, because, plain and simple, I don't want to. Neither one of the parties, and I don't even consider myself being in any kind of party to begin with. I'm not... Democrat, I'm not Republican, I'm not even really independent, you know, I just, especially with this one, I've never voted, I could have voted since, you know, I was 18, I'm 28 now, I've never voted, just to me, there's never been a president, in my opinion, worth voting for, uh, there's never been, a, you know, any side that I've been like, Oh yeah, you know, I like what that guy is saying. I'm gonna vote for him, just based on certain things that he said he'll do or won't do. Because to me, it's just like each party, especially now, is just full of shit. Everybody's just full of shit, and that's my opinion. There has never been a president, as far as you know. I've, to me, that's well, since the time I've been able to vote, that's been worth voting for, to me, in my opinion. Because the way I look at it, politics is just bullshit. It's all bullshit. It's all crap. They're going to say what they want to say and need to say because it's what the people want to hear. Okay, so now that we're on, we're on the topic, I really, like I said, didn't want to do this whole thing in the car, which I'm really not, but I'm just, you know, going to go off. I posted on Facebook, um, what I was talking about earlier in the video, I, and I put on there, I, I'm going to read it to you from my, from my page here, I put, no, I didn't vote, nor do I want to vote. We are damned if we do and damned if we don't. There is no lesser of the two evils. History repeats itself in all kinds of ways, as it will with the new president. We shall see what becomes of us as a nation. Shit's going to hit the fan, and it's going to be too late. Can't wait to see our power fall, because it will if you think if it hasn't already. This is my opinion. Fuck them all. See you on the other side. Maybe. And, of course, you know, you have some people who, you know, agree and blah, 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 this and that. And uh, I had my um, my uncle comment on there, which, uh, which is fine. Like I said, I'm not trying to argue with anybody. I'm just, everybody has their opinions. I posted on there. Everybody's able to, you know... Say what they want to say, and you know, and against me, with me, whatever. I mean, that's that's their right. So he put one man's opinion. Rob, if you're seeing this, you know I love you. He was one man's opinion, but think of this: if the shit has fallen, you seem to be doing quite well to be free enough to express your feelings and living well. I'm not telling you to to vote or pick the lesser of two evils, but what I'm saying is, don't bitch and moan when you're not willing to do anything about it. I said, I love you. He goes, I love you. And my reply was. I get what you're saying, and I'm doing well because of the fact that nothing that has gone on has affected me personally. I have never voted, so I also that's why I don't care who wins. Because and then something else does affect me, it would have been coming to me either way, since they're both pieces of shit. If one said something as simple as, I guarantee your college tuition will be reimbursed in full, or taking away, or taking away uh, paying for college and it will be paid by the government, then I would vote for that person on that alone. Just because that's the only thing that matters to me and I care about. Which that, what I mean by that is that is affecting me personally. Because I am a college student. So I said like that, like, hmm, maybe I should vote for that person if he's going to, I don't have to pay for college. Great. That's a, thousands and thousands of dollars, you know, that I can be saving if I'm not going to have to pay for college. It's going to be paid for by the government completely in full. That'd be awesome. It'd be really awesome. So, and I, uh, that's only I care about. So as long as I'm working and my family is taken care of, I can care less what the fuck happens. So nothing's, nothing, none of that affect, none of that affected me. So that's, you know, that's kind of my thing about it. So, uh, and then, 
that's kind of where I'm at right now. Again, I'll continue to do more on this a little bit later, as soon as I get somewhere, instead of the car. Okay, so, now I'm not in the car, I'm actually at my mom's house. I'm sitting in the garage, because, well, it feels good outside. And it's bright, I don't have to worry about the lighting being too too bad. So again, earlier, like, um, the last day I was arguing with uh, <laughs> my uncle on Facebook over this whole, this whole thing. Um, about the voting and stuff like that. It was just, it was just funny. Uh, like I said, as long as my family's taken care of. And, you know, like I said, I get it. And like he, he was saying also, he's, he, we, it's funny because we like to go back and forth. He's saying he's calling bullshit on me because he's saying, because uh, I told him I never voted. And he was saying, well, there was a great candidate by the name of Bernie Sanders who pushed for free college tuition, which I was talking about in the last comment. Again, not telling you to go vote, but you're contradicting yourself, and politics affect all of us in one way, hope, uh, one way, in one form or another. I was like, this is true, and I heard about that when he was running. But if he, if he's, but if say he did win, became our president, and was one and uh, one of the ones I voted for, then he turns around and doesn't keep his promise. Then well, shit, I'd be in the same boat as I was before I voted or even became president again, going back and not affecting me. And he's like, excuses, so now I heard about free education, but in case he doesn't keep his promise, I won't vote. Stop flip-flopping, you sound like a politician. Which probably be true, I probably do sound like a politician, but, you know, politicians are... Who likes politicians? Nobody. Anywho, so I told him I'm not flip-flopping, I'm just saying I'd rather not vote. I'm sure if he still won and kept his promise, that'd be great, but if I voted and he didn't, then I wouldn't want to be a part of the millions upon millions of people who did, and uh, and be like, damn it, I voted for them. I voted for that moron. No, thank you. I'll keep myself out of the polls. Then he finally said, I can respect that. I can respect that you say I'd rather not vote. At least you're keeping it real now. So that's kind of like my take on this thing, you know, because everybody always asking me, you know, why don't you vote? Why didn't you vote? Who are you voting for? I tell them I'm not voting. I'd rather not vote. Because uh, I don't like either of the candidates. I really don't. I mean, that's just, like I said, that's just my that's just my opinion. No one really sticks out. I'm not a Republican, Democrat. Um, sure as hell not independent, especially with these two. Because um, uh, it's just, I don't know. I just, you know, they say, I honestly think in some way, shape, or form that I just feel like our votes really don't matter. In a way, like to me, in my opinion, voting is a waste of time, especially with with the two the two parties that we have, the two people we have running for presidency now. Um, but again, like I said, this is my full disclosure, my full opinion. Um, so I mean, I really don't, I really don't care. I mean, the the, the stuff that they're saying now, and it's really not going to affect me too much. I really don't think it's going to affect me at all. I don't have to worry about, you know, family going back or being sent to Mexico if Trump gets elected or all this other bullshit, you know, that he says or all this other I'm, I'm, I was so, like, done with all this. Like, I don't even, I even stopped paying attention to all this stuff that's going on. I stopped paying attention to Trump. I stopped paying attention to Hillary, what they say, what they've done, what they want to do. I stopped paying attention completely because I heard just I heard enough to where it was just like whatever to me. Like I really didn't care. So that's my take on it. Um, if you have any comments or anything, please leave them down below. And if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, I just thought I'd throw this out here since today was election day. So if you like it, cool. If you don't cool like i said leave your comments i want to hear y'all's comments i want to hear y'all's opinion on everything and here's y'all's opinion on what i said because you know like i said we all have the right to, to vote we all have the right freedom of speech and i want to hear everybody so hopefully y'all enjoyed this and hear what i had to say and i will catch y'all later deuces